And hello, hello, everybody, and welcome to the Taste of Good weekly live stream. Good morning from a very beautiful Gapyeong, South Korea, where it is 10.30 here in the morning. We are at a very cool place, right? The Gapyeong Rail Park, where we are aboard one of these little rail bikes here. And we're going to be, for the next hour, riding along the beautiful county side here, the countryside of Gapyeong, South Korea and exploring so we're off in just a few moments thanks so much for hanging out with us if we're meeting for the first time <laughs> hi i'm paul from taste so good so we come live to you every single week live streams from around south korea it is cold here though but uh we are excited to be aboard this cool little rail bikes one of the most popular things to do i think here when you're in south korea is to take a little trip from seoul over to gapyeong to check out nami island we were at the garden of the morning calm yesterday and then as well as checking out this rail bike. So we are off here in just a few moments. It's gonna take about an hour for us to go around. The good news is that this is a motorized. Let me show you guys. Let me flip you around here. So these rail bikes here, we can use them manually, but hey, what's the fun in that, right? So it is motorized. It's gonna take us all along, except for about an hour. But look how beautiful the scenery is here. Before we get started, be sure to uh, give this video a big thumbs up, guys. Let me know where you're watching from. Set your notifications as we'll be live every single week. Thanks to everybody who's joining us here. Evelyn and Mandy and Jay Renee and Lynette and Bridget. Thank you, everybody, for hanging out with us. I've got Yumin here as well as look who, look who found their way over. Indy. <laughs> so Indy is here as well. Dogs are permitted here. So we are... Just, um, we are uh, just a few moments away. So, we're we'll leaving at 10 30. So, I guess we're just a little bit late. But once everybody gets going, we'll be separated. Hi, Sue. Hi, Atia, watching from Vancouver. Very cool. You guys, buckle in, grab a snack, grab a drink. We are uh, going to be off any second here. Do you guys have anything like this in your country? There's a few of these from around in different parts of South Korea. So we're supposed to cycle for a few minutes to get the engine going, and then we will have plenty of time to just stroll. So some of these are set up like families. I think there's like four to six people in a seat, but you have to buy at least two. So if you're traveling solo, you'll have to buy one car, which is uh, good for two people so you can find somebody else to do it. So... Before we get started, they gave us a little safety instructions and uh, told us what to expect and what to do. So, again, it'll be about an hour around. Hi, Linda. Say hey, Bokmani Badaseo. Happy Lunar New Year. Jeremy, none of that in Indiana, of course, right? Can't imagine anything like this in Indianapolis. So, we are just waiting. It's a beautiful night. So, I had to get this morning, take a train over here from where we were yesterday, the Garden of the Morning Calm. It was a quick seven-minute ride on the ITX, on the fast speed train over here. And then a quick little taxi ride, and we were over here. So the cost of this is, I think, 36,000 won for two people for the admission to get onto this. You know, we're supposed to be starting at 10.30, so... That's why we started our live stream a little bit earlier, but looks like we're just waiting. So we'll get going any minute. Hi, Aaron. Thanks for coming over here. Hi, Shirley. Good to see you. Hi, Margaret. Good evening again, guys. If you can, go ahead and give us a give us a video a thumbs up. We greatly appreciate it. Feel free to share it as well. Um, you know, the other platform isn't uh, allowing us to stream horizontally anymore. So that's why we are checking out YouTube again. I think we're getting ready to go in just a moment. Hopefully we'll have spectacular views of the area of Gapyong. There we go. So there, the first people are off. And he's going to give us a little space in between. And then we'll, it'll be our turn. All right, there they go. They're off to the races. We have to wait a minute. So again, at the beginning, we'll have to pedal a little bit. And about... All right, so humans doing the pedaling now. We're off, guys. 
Yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing all my part. You don't have to. Okay. <laughs> Look how fun this is. <laughs> so these are the bigger ones for the family. So you can have like four people there instead of just two. So maybe four and some kids. So again, we've got to leave some space safety first. Checking the brake. Oh, check the brakes. So we do have handheld brakes here. What are you doing? Surely it is motorized. Hi, Trish. Good to see you. Thanks for popping over. Good to see you. Okay, don't stop. Keep going. Okay, thank you. I can tell there's a lot of foreigners who come to this because he started speaking English. I was thrown off. Test the brake. Test the brake. So I think this rail bike is especially beautiful. In different seasons and spring and fall just like everything in korea spring and fall is the most beautiful but i want to just give you kind of the the view as we're seeing it so it is motorized so we get to relax probably one of the easiest live streams for me i, I must admit i get to just sit here and do nothing so we'll tell you guys that i think there's some points where we have to go through some tunnels so if i lose reception for a few moments as we go through the tunnels just stay patient bear with we'll go fast yeah, yeah, it's automatic now, so we're not controlling the speed, <laughs> but it seems like we're going really fast. Indy's enjoying it. <laughs> Ooh, oh my goodness. How fun is this? <laughs> Rolling with the homies. What movie is that from? Who could tell me? <laughs> uh, so the area around Gapyeong, it's really small. But if you want to come to this area, you can go to Nami Island, Garden of the Morning Calm. Uh, goes from Yongsan Station, takes about an hour or so from Yongsan Station. Clueless, ding, 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 Jay Renee, Bridget. So you guys are my people. I knew it. <laughs> you got to see this. Oh, no. Okay, never mind. I'm not going to show you. I want to show you Indy. Indy's enjoying it. Let <laughs> me turn you around. <laughs> Cute, right? This time of the year in Korea, everything's just gray and drab. So it's not the most beautiful time of the year, but oh well. We can still enjoy it. You guys, we may be live more often here on YouTube rather than the other platform simply because of the streaming um, limitations and restrictions that the other platforms put on us. So make sure you subscribe, you set your notifications. And if you want to change the quality of the video, check, there should be a little cog wheel, maybe down in the right hand corner for you. You can change it to maybe 720 or maybe even 1080, depending on where you are. And that will give you the higher resolution. And if you want to support our live streams and more adventures, then you can check the pinned comments. Ooh, it's so loud. You can check the pinned comments and uh, treat us to a cup of coffee. Much appreciated if you decide to do that. All right, so if you guys are hearing loud noises, it's just the sound of the motorbike. The rail bike, rather. Ooh, it's chilly, chilly. We need some hot packs. So I think about halfway, we will stop. I think we can get off for a few minutes. If I had to guess, there's probably food, because there's always food when you're in Korea. Oof. Cold, cold, cold. Hi, Jen. Indy's the best little boy. Absolutely. Linda, like you on YouTube because you're watching us on your 42 inch TV. Awesome. Shout out to Salem. 
If you guys like this, make sure you let me know. There's 31 people watching and only 17 thumbs up. So let's see if we can get that up to maybe 25 thumbs up. Can we do that really quickly? If you haven't already liked the video, go ahead and do that now. Ooh, it's much. How is the weather in Seoul? Much warmer, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's much colder here. Much more windy than it is in Seoul, for sure. Yeah, Trish, it's cold, but also really windy. That's the problem. Since we're going against the wind, that's okay. We pretty much bundled up. So if you want to do this rail bike experience, they do it at certain times, I believe, like 1030, maybe the next one's at one o'clock, something like that. So you have to um, probably book in advance. I don't think you have to book in advance, but during the, the peak seasons, you're probably going to want to for sure. We almost got 25 thumbs up. We got 23. We got close. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Jess. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining us today. And there's no one person. Two person or four person. Photo point. You have to pay two person. Yeah. So it says, look here, guys. They're going to take a picture of us. So smile. Oh, smile. All right. Got us. So later, whew, later we can uh, check that picture out. Because if you want to come here, the only bad thing is, is that you can't just do, I mean, you can't, I'm sure you can do it by yourself. You're just going to have to pay for two people. This has got to be really beautiful in the autumn with all the leaves here. I love this type of live stream. I want to do rail bike live streaming all the time. I don't have to do any work. I just sit here and relax and just talk. It's kind of amazing. This is my favorite live stream ever. Yes, you can be relaxed. <laughs> yeah, you got to do some pedaling. Thanks for bringing me here and pedaling. <laughs> Make him do all the work. <laughs> no, I, you don't need to. It's all uh, why are you pedaling? Just a little more faster. No, you, must, you don't have to pedal. You was doing it. Just to uh, make it go faster. I don't think we need to go any faster. 54 degrees in Salem. You guys want to... Hi, Nancy. You're heading this way soon? Again? Nice. Aaron in Chicago says, Thank you, human, for your hard work. I feel like this is a place we'll definitely be coming back to in the different seasons. Hey, Katie Ann. Katie and W, hello. All right, so they're coming back the other way. Do we make a circle? Yeah. Uh, so. Chuncheon and then turn around and go back. All right, so we're going to go to Chuncheon and then I think we can get off for a minute and then we come back around. Chuncheon is famous for Takalbi, everybody. The home, the birthplace of Takalbi. Chicken, spicy stir-fried chicken, which if you haven't tried, you're missing out. Oh, you got to try it. Chuncheon, Takalbi. Ooh, we're going fast. Ooh, wee. It's like a roller coaster. We're I mean, like Alpine Mountains. <laughs> oh my God, yeah, the faster we go, the colder it gets. Ah! Look at how they close each other. <laughs> Yeah, they're all close. Maybe they're all... There's a puppy. Hi, puppy. Let's go. Whoa, we're going so fast. <laughs> Check out the mountains behind me. <laughs> but again, if you want to come here, best to do it with somebody else. So you, you're going to be paying the same price if you're doing it solo or if you're doing it with people. Oh, two people. Oof. Maybe slow down a little. Yeah, maybe slow down a bit. We're gonna rush right through this. 
<laughs> uh, guys are saying it's fun. Oh, yes, Jess, no worries. Happy birthday to your daughter as well. Yeah, you, let's see. Oh, pool villa. There's you, man. And Indy Bear, enjoying his best life. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, hopefully my nose is running. I can't feel anything. My nose is numb. J. Renee asks, human, is it hard to pedal or since it's motorized, is it easy? It's definitely easier. He's not really pedaling now, just pedaling um, occasionally. It's a nice house. It's probably a, a pension you can rent. Why are they so slow now? They're slowing down. Oh, there's somebody up there. Soda Makuksu. Makuksu's a. Is Makuksu buckwheat noodles? Uh, maybe because there's a, a road crossing here. Uh, the car is close here. Yeah. Look at that little restaurant. They're also serving makuksu. Main meal um, was buckwheat, buckwheat, pancakes, different things. I imagine a lot of these are like pensions, rental places. You can see the signs here. Gapyeong's really famous for the um, vacation. I've gone to some of these. Oh, water sports. Or, yeah, for water sports. There's a big water park here, too. But I've been here. Um, for different like retreats or for friends' birthdays, uh, up in the mountains, it's beautiful. It's lovely. They have lights up here, but a lot of people come here from Seoul to relax and to have uh, barbecues and things like that. It's gonna be beautiful in the fall. Yeah, in spring. Can you do nighttime? It's rolling too good. Yeah. <clears throat> really relaxing for sure. I bet it's so beautiful in the fall. Imagine all of these trees just lined with red and yellow and orange leaves. It'd be absolutely stunning. What do you guys think? Are we coming back here in October? Mark it on the calendar. It's really hard to get tickets, like the peak season. But I'm sure it's worth it. If you can get tickets, I'm sure it's definitely worth it. Did you see all the leaves on the track? So is anybody celebrating anything special this week? I always like to ask. I know Jess's daughter is having a birthday. But is anybody else celebrating anything special? Any uh, birthdays? Anything that you guys want to share? The Taste So Good family here? For us, we're still celebrating the Lunar New Year. Still, it's day three of a four-day weekend. So we're still off tomorrow. Everything will be shut down and then back to work on Tuesday. There's some nice pensions though. And if you missed our little buy me a coffee websites in the pinned comment, FYI. Jenny, our pleasure. Thanks for hanging out with us. Matt. Hi, Matt. Italian Matt. Welcome, welcome. 
Aaron will come back out. We can do a group ride. All right. Margaret, February 11th is your 70th birthday. <gasps> Shout out to you, Margaret. When is today February? I think today's February 11th here in Korea or in uh, this part of the world. So happy birthday to you, Margaret. Can we all put a birthday cake in the chat for Margaret? Celebrate the big 7 0. Very cool, very cool. Trish, wouldn't it be beautiful? I know, that's what we're just saying. We'll have to come back. Check it out again. Lynette made duck mandu juke today. Juker goop. Did you make mandu soup? Rice cake soup or rice? Oof. I assume that was supposed to be uh, soup, not juke. Juke is porridge. The rice cake porridge might be kind of yummy too. So these pool villas usually have a pool in each room. I stayed in a motel last night. I think it was about 45,000 Korean won. It was actually really nice. I was just there for a few hours. But it's one of those no-tell motels, if you get my drift. You can rent it for three hours or five hours or overnight. I rented it overnight, obviously. But it, it comes with everything that you may need for a little bit of fun. For you or your significant other. Yeah, I assume that's what you meant. Everybody else is so close that, like, look at all these people. They look like they're from Southeast Asia. Come here to have a little, little party. We shout out to the Philippines. There's a lot of Southeast Asian tourists here. Last night was the Garden of the Morning Call. I think it's also because it's a. There's a lot of um, migrant workers, and so when there's a big holiday like this, they have the time off, so they travel around as well, just like the rest of us. A lot of tourists everywhere, but also just people who, foreigners who live in Korea, that don't get to leave the the area as much. Okay, so these pool pensions. Gosh, I don't like those noises though. They each have a private pool inside. So you can rent it. And, uh, you can have a nice little party. Ooh, they got scary suddenly. Look at a big drop off. There should be music or something here. That would make it more more lively. My goodness, who is that? It just says someone. I'm not sure. Somebody contributed a hundred dollars to our coffee fund. Thank you, thank you. I'm not sure who it is. It just says someone. Please let me know who that was. Thank you so much. Who that was? It's very uh, generous. Thank you so much. I don't know. Let me know who I uh, contributed. Sorry, my hands are so rags. It's how cold it is. <laughs> Somebody who contributed $100 to our coffee fund. This is Gabriella. 
Janita says I start singing, you do not want to hear me singing. It was you, oh my gosh. Thank you, my friend. Thank you, thank you. Always. Thank you. <laughs> you would scare. You says thank you as well. <laughs> we could uh, definitely enjoy some iced coffee. Thank you that so much for that. Greatly appreciated. Especially on a cold day like this, you definitely treat yourselves to something warm. Thank you again. All right, I think maybe we're getting to another crossing up here. Looks like it's slowing down a little bit. There's a lot of signs saying don't smoke. Like, who's coming out here to smoke? Apparently, a lot of people. It says there can be mountain fires if you because smoke. Not, not in Korea, a lot of fire on the mountain uh -huh. because from the the drivers they threw the uh -huh. cigarette out of window. Uh -huh. So you've been saying that there's in Korea there's a lot of fires in the mountains because people just throw their cigarettes out of the car window. Obviously, Korea is like seventy percent covered with mountains. If you're really careful, especially this season, it's really dry. I think they need to oil the wheels, though, to make it a little less noisy. <laughs> That's the only thing about this. It's really, really noisy. If you guys haven't already, be sure you give this video a big thumbs up. You can hit the like button. Maybe this is where we get off. We are here already. It's been 30 minutes. Almost. Little lambs. Alright, so I think we're in Chunchan. So I think this is the area where we get off. And then we'll get back on. Uh, it's a uh, thanks to Gabriela. Always our pleasure to live stream. And uh, thanks for your support. It helps us. Keep doing them. So, so think, thank you. Alright, so I think we're going to get off and take a break for 10 minutes. And then go back. And then we'll go back. So I think once we get up here, we're going to exit the rail bike. Look at yeah, this puppy. is puppy. Oh, look at the little puppy. There we uh, They have a little dog park there. Maybe we can stop by there really quickly. We got 10 minutes. I don't know. All right, slow down. It says so. I think we're gonna we have to hop off here. Oh, look, there's a sign right there. Pet bike. All right, guys. So hold up. We're going to exit here. All right, hold on, wait for... 266, okay, so we're going to get the same one. All right. So we're at the little rest area here. So everybody can take a little bit of a break. Look who's here. Happy boy here today. And so there's a photo booth. So let's see if we can find our photo from earlier. So I think we've got about 10 minutes. There's a little doggy park. Maybe Indy can go pee pee. Maybe does Indy need go pee? All right, we're gonna go check this out. So once we get back on, see the pet bike, and then how cool is this? I love this little thing. They have an area, so if you're taking your dog, you get to uh, bring him in here. How cool is that? So there's a little rest area even for the puppies. 
and it's free. Oh my gosh, we have to go explore. Uh, there's a lot of people with dogs that are doing this. Wasn't expecting all of this. <laughs> How cute! There's a little indie bear. Hi, Jane. Trish, we're going to be heading back, though. So don't worry about that. We're going to... This is just a halfway point. There's a lot of people with puppies. Indy. Did we get least here? No, of course not. This is a puppy play area. See if you'll go through here. <laughs> Little obstacle courses for dogs. His old bones won't allow him to go up and down the slide, but... Let him go pee-pee. Indy Bear, hi. You're just joining us. Hi, welcome to uh, Gapyong, South Korea. Oh, I think he's going to go to the toilet. You don't need to see that. <laughs> All right. We have Tuho over here, Korean traditional game. Let's walk around. So I'll let you take care of this. Hold on, let me put my bag on. Oh. Hey, give me one second, guys. I hope you. <laughs> it'd be cool if Indy went through there, but he's almost 14. Can you just hold on to it? I'm going to go out here. All right. I love this, though. I think it's really cool that they have this. All right, let's go see what else is at this little rest area. Korean traditional game called Tuho. You can see them playing there. This, so this, I guess, used to be a train station. Gyeonggang, Gyeonggang Yo. Hugue, uh, Hugue, uh, rest stop. So I think back in the day, this was a real train station. Goodbye. Oh, look. Does anybody know this? The letter? Pyonji? I don't know if it was a drama or a movie. Looked like it filmed here. There's a puppy cafe here, too. So these are the different times that you can take the rail bike. 9, 10, 30, 12, 2, and 3, 30. So, oh, pet bike is 45. I don't know what the pet bike is, but we didn't do that one, I don't think. Maybe it's different. Maybe it's one we're supposed to do. Let's see if we can find our photo. Oh, look, here we are. It's us. Yeah. Okay. We're not allowed to take a picture of it, but we did it anyways. I didn't take a picture. I took a live stream. I took a video. It's kind of a cool picture, though, right? Let's see what they have going on over here. So if you need to go pee-pee, you can put your dog here. Just put them, put their leash through here, a little dog holder. I must buy that photo. I'm just seeing what it is. Might have to. 
Look at those signs for <laughs> people go to the toilet. Oh, look. Look how cute it looks in the summertime. So they have Taiwan sandwichy, slushies, different beverages and coffee, walnut cookies. Trish would like to see the difference between the pet bike and the regular one. Yeah, I'm curious too. I don't know which one is the pet bike. I think a pet bike might just have that area to put your dog, like in a carrier. Put them in the front. Oh, I love traditional Korea like this. I think we have to get ready, Tess. You have to get ready to go back. What do you guys think about the live streams on YouTube? I think it takes a little bit of getting used to, but I just don't know if I want to go do vertical only. Uh oh. I want to see what's going on here. Can I go in here? Oh, how cute. We can leave a letter. Photo point guide. Uh, tell me where to buy the photos. Look at the old school heater. Then that would be making tea. Trish, it say, you say the image quality is terrible? Interesting, because it seems like it's better. For most people... But yeah, we've had that issue as well, I guess, when we we're somewhere really crowded. But, you know, the, the problem is, I wish I had a paper here. I could write our names on it. Uh, the problem is, though, is that I don't think I want to do just vertical only video. And that's the way Facebook is making us do it. They're making us go only, unless it's just a fluke, just a bug that's happening. But if it's not, then I just don't know if I want to do... Because they want to compete with TikTok, right? So they want everybody to be vertical live streams. And I just don't know if that works for the type of content that we're doing. If you can only... If you can only see what we're showing you vertically, I just don't know if that works really well. All right, so that's us 266. We're going to hop back on. All right. So this is what it looks like from behind. You have a nice little area for your bags. And then... Ta-da! Captain's seat. <coughs> All right, can you hold for a second? Okay. Buckle up. All right, so we're buckled up. Now just waiting to uh, 
quote unquote take off. It's blurry too. Yeah, so it looks like people are having different different uh, experiences with the quality. But yeah, as Mandy's saying, I just don't know. Because if we do vertical, you get to see just this much. You know, it's a very, very narrow view. Which I just don't know if I want to do. But when I reviewed the footage from last night, it seemed to be pretty clear. At least on my end. But we're also, as you can see, not in the city right now. So the quality may not be too great right now. Simply also because we are in the middle of mountains. So that could have something to do with that. <laughs> Whereas when we are back in Seoul, we might have better quality. So we'll have to see. What's up? All right. We're gonna get going. All right, Gabriella, thank you so much. Thanks again for your your uh, generosity. Greatly appreciate it. We'll see you next time. <laughs> You guys say the image is grainy. All right. Last night seemed clearer than today's. Yeah. So it might have, it might be our location that we're dealing with today, too. Yeah. All right. Time to go back. Having Landscape does have more video image. Yeah. So I, I guess I got to think about it. I got to. I gotta put some thought into it. Which platform is better? Again, I like the interaction on the other platform, but uh, I just don't. Compare the last two platforms. The space will be always better. The quality. Quality-wise, yeah. Which is disappointing because YouTube is a video platform. Maybe I'll test it next week. Vertical only. Live streaming, you guys can let me know if you like that. But I don't ever, I see vertical only live tours, like I don't watch them. Because I, I feel like I'm not there. At least with the horizontal, I feel like I'm a little bit more involved. So. Pros and cons to everything in life, right? Pedal, 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 put the pedal to the metal. Hopefully, though, regardless of what platform you're on, hopefully you guys will still hang out with us. I guess best case scenario is that the Facebook thing is just a little bit of a fluke and it'll be back to normal in a few days. And then so we can do horizontal there. If not, I don't know. Or, look at that little restaurant. Or we can do what we used to do. Oh, they're barbecuing some meat over there. Get in my belly. <gasps> oh, that is my favorite charcoal grilled spicy chicken. Oh, yeah. I guess we always try to do what we did last time, which was one Facebook, one YouTube. A week.
I'll, uh, I'll think about it. We will go to private pool villa. Jane says, last night video today, it's okay for right now. All right. Mandy's true that sometimes Facebook is really blurry as well. So a lot of it depends. I've realized if we're away from the cell towers, but also for some are really crowded, like the festivals, and it's always grainy. So, hi, Carol. Yeah, true. Depends on. And, um, Trish says no matter, she'll always follow us. So that's most important, right? Carol, we are at the Gapyeong Rail Bike. Hi, Chrissy. Happy Lunar New Year. We're actually, nobody's pedaling, guys. It's all motorized. So we don't have to pedal. There's just some little parts where you have to pedal. Or to get it started. You pedal a little bit at the beginning. But this whole part, nobody's pedaling. <laughs> don't worry. It's just relaxing. No pedaling. And if you guys are a VIP for a channel sponsor, you get one highlighted message a month, FYI. So if you want, you can check that out. If you didn't use it already, you get a special message one time a month. Perk of being a VIP. See, they're all so close to me. Oh, that's a pet bike. I it was all say pet bike, but the only difference with the pet bike is you get that little spot in the front where you can put the dog on the carrier. But I really do like how this is so dog friendly and have the little rest area for the puppies. And we can take the KTX from Yongsan Station and the KTX is dog friendly. So it works out well. Jane likes on Facebook. It's much clearer. All right. Thanks, Mandy. Mandy, can't figure out how to highlight a message. Um, I think you have to go to the little dollar sign. Oh, they got a puppy. Dollar sign. There is a free section. There is a one free free membership section. Yeah. So if you go to like the little dollar sign thing, then there should be one that says like highlighted message or something one to that effect one membership for free charity one time yeah one time a month but yeah click the little dollar sign that should show you This would be good. I think everything I think about is Halloween. I used to be really good at decorating like Halloween. Like if they put scary stuff and you're riding through and it's all scary, and then if you're scared, you have to pedal. Wouldn't that be funny? It was like a haunted rail bike experience. I think it'd be fun. Hi, Ronnie. One of the qualities clear in your phone, but grainy in your PC. Interesting. Again, maybe as we get closer to the... Well... We'll have to see. I feel like it, it... It's hard to fully make an assessment when we're out in the countryside like this. Again, we got mountains to the right. Mountains to the left. There's a Dubumaru. Toku village. So it could just be the area. And surely a hot Halloween would be fun, right? Jeremy, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yay! 
Thanks, Jenny. Aaron loves Halloween. Yeah, Halloween's always fun. Well, not always. Usually. So, got Pyong, Tangwondo, you can see, this is, uh, they held some of the 2018 Olympics here. So, up there, the remnants of the uh, 2018 Winter Olympics mascots. You can see them from behind there. I can get there. Do, 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 do. Hard to. Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh. Want to do anything Halloween? I used to like Halloween when I was younger. I want to live here. I need to find more live streaming things that I can do like this, where I don't have to move, where I can just sit down and just hold the camera and talk. And I get to talk comfortably because there's no awkwardness because I'm not like, oh, somebody's listening to me. <laughs> there's nobody around me to listen. Up here is the Dubu Ma, the Topu Village. Kangwando. Are we in Kangwan? No, we're still in Gyeonggi-do, aren't we? They're famous for their tofu. Achim Shiksa. Breakfast food. Morning food. So this little place is serving up lots of different um, tofu. My hands are freezing, y'all. All right, getting back to the rail crossing up here. Crossing ahead. Everybody wave hi to this nice man. Shout out to him. He's got a, a cold job. Everybody's selling corn. That little vendor, that truck, is selling corn. Lots of you know, more pool villas. Ooh. They should have sold hot packs. I didn't expect it's hot. It's cold. I know. They should have sold them at the little intersection. Hey, Tom. Can you please stop singing? If the motor does not start, pump the brake pedal once or twice. That does not work. The rear bike will push you. Well, that's... That's uh, not at all concerning. Your motor breaks down. The car behind you will just push you, will tow you. That's where I'm going to be staying this summer. Oh, true. There's another rail bike near Yuma's hometown. Maybe in the springtime. We'll have to head over there. And then, I'm moving. Yeah. I'm moving. Yeah. I'm fucking ray bike. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And Bordeong's nice, too. So there's a, a number of rail bikes in the country. I know. We I don't have any hand warmers because I didn't think it was going to be so cold. So, Gapyong's famous, oh, I kind of missed it, for their water sports. So, you can come out here as well and do like, uh, they like water. You can kind of see there. Not, yeah, not like, not like a water park like you're probably thinking of, but like little um, areas you can rent like jet skis and tubes and um, pair, what do you call it, parasailing. Y'all, if you've ever not, if you've ever gone parasailing, that's the scariest thing in the world. We went parasailing in. That noise is really loud. We went parasailing in Bali. It's just such a random sentence to come out of my mouth. And then parasailing in Bali, but it was so scary. <laughs> Why was if you're the last rail car of the day? That's a good, a good point, Trish. I don't know what would happen. There's a number down here, so you can call them. And I guess they'll they'll come by and help you. I imagine there's probably. I don't know. Yeah, I'm sure you just call this number. But I'm sure they'd also realize. Or maybe there's somebody at the end. The last one's actually a worker to make sure that doesn't happen. Did you see our picture? No. Who's back there? What is it? Who's back there at the at the rest stop? You wouldn't get to see the picture. Did we take a screenshot of the picture? How was it? It was nice. I wanted to buy it, but I forgot. There wasn't enough time. I don't know. They should have the rail bike pictures at the entrance. That makes more sense. I wish they they should like have a big tent around this. <laughs> oh, we're going so fast. Oh! <laughs> ah! The people in front of us must be going really, really fast because they're nowhere to be seen. They're probably going here. Oh, they're way over there on the bridge. Oh, gosh, we're going so fast. I think we're heading, we're getting back close to the end here. Gosh, my nose is so red. I hope face is red. It's so pretty, though. Oh, I flip back around. Yeah, Jerry, we'll check at the entrance to see if we can get it. If not, then uh, we can just screenshot it. I'm sure it's somewhere. Oh, the ducky ducky down there, the little oh, my head is frozen. 
At least Indy's nice and warm. He's bundled up. That's blurry. Well, again, um, I don't know. It could just be our location that, you know, any platform would be blurry. Like, I see other people live streaming on YouTube. They have, like, nice 1080p crisp live streams. Whenever I do it, it's always blurry. I don't know why. Because if you're doing outside live streams, right. I see other people do outside live streams. Same. Like a guy that I follow in Tokyo, his live streams are always so clear. <laughs> Huh? All right, so I think we're approaching the end of our rail bike excursion here. Residential area. Be quiet. The mess says not blurry for her. Yeah. So I guess I think a lot of it might just depend on your guys's geographic area too. Look at that black house. Looks like a goth house. Everything's black. It's 720 though. It's still pretty, pretty good. Much higher than what we can get on Facebook. All right, so we're approaching the end, unfortunately, of the rail bike. That was a quick hour. We were out here for an hour. A fun hour. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We can kind of feel the vibrations. Especially as we go over some sections. So we've got... It's only 1130. We don't have a train until like three o'clock. You know what that means? Coffee time. Hopefully, that will be time. I want to walk back to that that one barbecue that will be place. Well, my hands are numb. Alright, so here we are approaching the end. <laughs> Y'all, you may just not pedaling. Don't let that man fool you. He's only pedaling a little bit here and there. It's not not much. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, hold on, we're gonna exit the rail bike. But no, it, it's ninety-nine percent motorized. <clears throat> Alright, put on the just exit, grab my bag. Oh, can you hold for a second? Hey man, can you hold this for a second so we can put my bag on? Uh, Alright. Alright, so what's next on the agenda? I don't know. We'll have to see. I don't think there's that much around here. Uh, ooh, you're. Jacket's all wet. 
want on talent that is the seat is wet. <laughs> so when you come here to do the the rail bike, you have to sit here and wait. And then they give you a little safety demo. Oh, there's an Isak toast. Maybe we can just take a look around. I think you get a discount. You go to these restaurants with your ticket, 20% during the week or 10% um, on the weekend. That's a, a good little perk. <gasps> There's my favorite no brand shop. It's my favorite store. Uh, it's, see, I'm gonna see if I can find a, a hot pack. Trish, um, we're gonna walk around. We'll see what's up. We'll see. I can't say if it's the end or not. Let's see if there's anything around here that we can look at. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Find somewhere warm to go into. It's actually not as cold once you're walking around. It was just sitting stationary with that going against the wind. <laughs> it got really cold. What I need is a fish cake. Fish cakes always warm you up. Especially you get that fish cake soup there, fish cake on a skewer. That always warms you up, makes you feel better. A cold day, you don't need a hand warmer, you just need to hold a cup of hot, oh gosh, cup of hot fish cake soup. A fish cake broth, rather. You see what's in this general area. Again, so the reception might just be blurry, guys, simply because, look, there's not a whole lot going on in this area. Which is why people come here, though. People like to come here for a little rest and relaxation and to see the mountains and the, the rivers and just nature. There's just quite a bit of stuff around here. Gapyeong Market. Y'all know I love me a traditional market, right? If you've never met me, hi, my name is Paul and I love Korean traditional markets. Gapyeong Chetgol Shijang. I don't know where Yimin went. Oh, there he is. Let's see. Oh, there's a Saturday market from uh, April through October. Looks like a night market. We're here. I think if we go that way, we can head to the traditional market. Human, let's walk over to this market. Do you guys want to see a market? Do you want to go with me? That market right there says just straight ahead. Here. We can just try. Alright, we're gonna go see. It might not be open because 
It is the holiday. No brand. But we'll go take a look to see if the market is open. Jay says, yes, please. We'll do, we'll do. If you guys haven't already, be sure to give the video a thumbs up, please. We have 34 thumbs up. Can we get to 40 really quickly? Yeah, let's get to 40. Can you give the video a like? Is the image quality any better now that we're a little closer to a town? Well, look at this cute little area. All these are different vendors. Coffee shops and street food and chicken. This must be the, the night market. We got 34 thumbs up. Oh, thumbs up, guys, in the uh, not in the chat, but on the actual video itself. There's a little button to give the video a like. Actually, I don't know where the market is. It says just straight down here. I love these little cities, though. These little towns. These little villages sometimes. It's always so nice to get out of Seoul and enjoy these different places. Look at this little restaurant. Gamja Tang. Or Heijangguk, rather. Just right here. So Morty, a uh, cowhead soup, hangover soup. Slightly better, he wouldn't rave about the quality. Oh no. Well, unfortunately, it's the best that I can do right now. I'll test it out once we get back to Seoul. Maybe I'll do a live stream tomorrow on Monday when we're back in Seoul. And then we can we can do a little better comparison, I think, when I'm actually back in the city. This is the market. Apparently, this is the market. It's not a whole lot to see. I think most things are closed. Again, it could be because of the holiday. This is a Nakji restaurant. Nakji meaning um, octopus. It says it's a healing, healing matji. Makes you heals your body. Tola Tongdak. Tongdak meaning whole fried chicken. So I think what I'll do tomorrow, I have to check the weather, but tomorrow, you guys might have to catch the replay, but what I might do is do a vertical live stream on Facebook and do a horizontal live stream on YouTube when we're in Seoul, even though they're both a little bit short. And then you guys can go back and compare the two and tell me which one do you prefer. We can test out the quality, again, when we're back in Seoul. It'll be a little, should be better there. But we can also check the vertical to see what you guys think. So maybe that's what I plan to do tomorrow. I don't know where I'll go. Somewhere simple, likely, um, just as a test. So, ooh, smell. Bunga bang. Fish, fish bread. 
fish shaped bread rather. Usually filled with the red beans, but this one's like it's filled with custard. You can see there. It smells yummy. You know, bong. guys all right i think what we're gonna actually do especially if it is blurry i think i'm going to just maybe start to wrap it up here so we can find somewhere warm i need to un i need to defrost my nose <laughs> and uh yeah so i think we might head up have some lunch really quickly before we catch a train back to seoul but i think tomorrow since tomorrow is a holiday again i'll do a kind of a double live stream even something just kind of simple um, so both here on YouTube and also on Facebook, we test the vertical one. We can get a little feel for the differences in between the two platforms that we can think about it and, um, then get your feedback and I can decide kind of ultimately what the, the future of the live streams, where they'll be and all that jazz. So anyways, I think, yeah, I'm going to start to sign off here. Um, only a little over an hour, but we going to find somewhere warm. So, and we have a dog to take care of as well. So, yeah. Anyways, thanks for hanging out with us, guys. Hopefully you enjoy. Thanks for uh, joining us here on YouTube. But, again, I will be live tomorrow with a little bit of a test. So, love you for watching. Have a great day. And uh, thanks for hanging out. And we'll see you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. All right. Take care. And uh, see you there. Bye.